Ladies and gentlemen, good morning out there. It is June 20th, 2023, and it is 7.30 a.m. Guys, I think we should have a welcome back party because I'm getting all the love, the feedback. Guys, thanks for welcoming back, and uh, man, it does feel good to be back, but on another note, it did feel really good to be away. Guys, we are back at it again, Tuesday morning. A little overcast here in the tri-state area, but we're not gonna let that stop us. And you know what? We're gonna not, we're not gonna let the people that need our help over in the borough of Manhattan stop us either. Guys, we're gonna be in the borough of Manhattan all day today. I'm gonna make this one piece of content summing up of all three service calls, and I'm gonna try to keep it under 25 minutes. Guys, that's what YouTube's telling me. That's what the fan club is telling me. So we're going to listen to what you guys are suggesting. And we're going to see if we're going to make it or break it. Guys, on this first service call here, we are going to a new customer's house who came highly recommended from a building we do work in from the super. And it just so happens the super is Maltese. So we're going to get him on the phone. And we'll probably get him on the phone as we're heading to Manhattan just so you can hear the dialogue that we have with this nice gentleman. So um, he had the nicest things to say about Malta when we went there two weeks ago. And uh, we're going to call him our first time back. So uh, we're going to tell him how we loved the island. And uh, we're going to let him know how nice the Maltese people are. But guys, on this first service call, we're going to a mysterious leak that cannot be found in this million dollar apartment here if you guys follow the content this is the building where we went to where we changed those coils on those p-tech units that froze months ago um not months ago in the later part of last year in those frigid months that we had so uh we're gonna head there now and uh we're gonna get you some awesome content of trying to locate this leak that's occurring and the gentleman doesn't know if it's coming from his bathroom or outside the bathroom we don't really know, but when we get there, we're going to get the full story like you all should, guys. Try to put all the pieces together. Try to get bits and pieces as much as we can get from the super, from the homeowner, from the freaking house cleaner. As much as information that you can get is valuable and try to put the pieces together. Guys, let's go do it and uh, let's go head on to the borough of Manhattan. Here we go. All right, guys. So since I have you here, I'm going to call the super here and try to get as much information as we can let's give him a call and see what we're working up against here <clears throat> hope everybody's enjoying their morning out there let's call my buddy sheldon see if he wants to be on tv this morning no, he's not answering. The city that never sleeps is sleeping. Oh. Hey, Sheldon, good morning there, sir. How we doing? I'm doing good. How about you? I'm not well, man. I don't I don't want to be back, man. I miss Malta. <laughs> How was it? How was it? How was it? It was great. Best time of my life. Yeah, I loved it, man. Very nice. Nice people. The island is beautiful. You know what I really liked? I like the island of Gozo. I'm from Gozo, man. You went to Gozo as well? I went to Gozo. Yeah, yeah. I went to Gozo. We rented a car. It was amazing. Yeah, I'm from Gozo. Really? The small island. Yeah, the small yeah. island. Very nice. Very nice. I see, I see the people. You they. The what do you say? Yeah, we had a really good time, man. Really good time. Really good time. Yeah. The island the island has changed though. What do you mean? A lot of a lot of different people there. A lot of a lot of different minorities there. You have fucking people immigrants coming on boats left, right, and something. Yes, a lot of immigrants around. A lot of different type of nationalities living there. Right. When they had all those fights, you know, when they chose on the government and all that. 
Exactly. Yeah, yeah. But the history, the history is amazing, you know? The history is amazing. A lot of people, a lot of countries try to take over Malta. A lot of, they try to. Oh, yeah. yeah. The Germans, the Italians, yeah. I was there two weeks. Oh, in Gozo, only two days. In Gozo, two days. Yeah. Why are you staying in Gozo? Wow, you know what? I don't remember the name. We stayed at a friend's house. I don't remember the town. Um, but this guy, he had uh, he had a big, he had a big farm. He had um, horses, everything. I forgot the name of the town. It sounds familiar, maybe. No, Sharpia, I think it is. Yeah. Yeah, very nice, very nice place, man. Of course, I go to the beach every day. Which beach you went? You went to, you went to, the, beach or you went to the beach or not? Yeah, I did. We stopped by for lunch over there and we swam a little bit. Okay, so, so you went to the red sand beach? Right? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Amazing. Oh my God. Topless, topless women all over the place. Yeah, you went to Camino to the small island. No, that's the one island. That's the one island we didn't go, Camino. Yeah, we went to Sicily instead. We went to Sicily. Yeah, my father's from there, so I went to go see his house. It was it was pretty nice. Pretty nice. Yes, yes, yes. A lot of garbage there. A lot of garbage in uh, in uh, Catania, in Sicily. Catania. A lot of garbage. I know, yeah, they steal from you, rob people, yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially your wallet, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, you gotta keep your money in your front pocket. Wow, pretty nice, though. Pretty nice. Yeah, very nice. But hey, Sheldon, I'm heading to your building this morning. Yeah, apartment four. Apartment four. What are they say, uh, what's the customer's name? De Declan? D-E-C, Declan. He said he got a, a leak he cannot find. Do you know anything about this? He said that you know. Yeah. 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 Okay. But to me, uh, I don't know when this happens. But uh, he's not there. He was away for a long time. Right. The floor is not wet. Nothing is wet. So maybe somebody spilled water or something. So he might have called you to come and have a look and see if there's any leak. I know we have a shower behind. Me. Like, like, right, right. Yeah, okay. I'm going to give him an hour of my time and, uh, you know. I'm gonna go there. Maybe I, you know, I'm gonna bring the infrared gun out and see. Maybe I could see something. That's it. That's it. Listen. Yeah. I have. You remember? You, you, you and your guy. You did that castle for Kate. Yes. 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 I have. I have another woman. I'm doing an apartment in the same building. I have another one. The stove is out. You think you could help me change the bar? No one. Yeah, why not? I come, I come see you. I'll buy the bars and everything, and we just take it off. Everything is off. The stove is disconnected. There is no kitchen. We just need to. It's the same thing like last time. We just need to take out that whole part of the new one. Okay, I come see you. I'm heading to Manhattan now. I come see you. Okay, I call you. Call me and then we'll see you. Okay. All right, Sheldon. Thank you. You man. got Thank it. You bye, bye 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 bye. <clears throat> Man, what a really nice guy. And you can tell he's from Malta because of the accent. Guys, let's go head to Manhattan and uh, let's go find this mysterious leak. Here we go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we just got here in the borough of Manhattan, the borough where you guys do not like to go. Uh, I'm not sure why, because there's a ton of money to be made and people pay. You guys don't know that by now. But guys, we got a new member of the team out here. New member of the team. He is happy to come on board and 
He's a gentleman. Been working with him for what do you think? Quite a few weeks now. Yeah, quite a few. Weeks quite now. a few weeks now, and we're gonna give him a nice, warm welcome. And guys, give a big thumbs up to the new member of the team, Brian. What's Say up, what's up. Nice to meet you. This is Brian here. He is a young gentleman. He is a guy who's been doing plumbing for about four or five years now, and uh, he loves what he does. And uh, we love to have him on board. Um, he definitely knows his stuff. There is a lot more to learn here. Guys, we do not know everything out here. We are learning each day, and he has a bright future. And um, I'm happy to bring him on, man. There is a... Uh, how, how do you like the trade? You love the trade? Man, I love I love everything that has to do with the trade. Plumbing, heating, cooling, everything, man. He loves it. He is a gentleman, and he's going to go very far in this life. Keep uh, keep up the good work. Keep striving for the best. Thank you, man. And, uh, man, there is a ton of opportunity out here. Guys, there really is. Um, keep striving for the best. You know, market yourself. I can't stress it enough, man. Word of mouth. Keep building relationships. Keep keep striving for, man. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Sometimes I get a little tongue tied, but there's a there's a bunch of opportunity out here. There really yeah, is. there's definitely. You just gotta portray yourself in a way that you're positive and honest, and then everything else will just come. Everything's you know, gonna fall into place, everything guys. Everything will fall into place, yeah. Exactly, guys. We're gonna knock out a few service calls here, and uh, the first one we're going to um, a leak, and mysterious leak. Let's call it a mysterious <laughs> leak. You know, we're going into a building that we've been working in for the, I don't know, last few years now, and uh, right now we're gonna meet the super, and uh, we're gonna get the full story. So, guys, try to get the full story of what's actually going on, and. Uh, Let's keep this intro short. So I just wanted to introduce the new member of the team and uh, let's go knock out this service call. Here we go. Let's go. All right, so we got some of the story from the super, right? He definitely doesn't know if there's a leak or not, but... It may be or may not be a leak. We're gonna see. What do you think? What do you think it is? I think it's definitely a little leak. You think so? We're gonna use the... We're gonna use the Fleer's i7 infrared camera and we're gonna see if there's a leak, so... We're gonna go do some investigating and poking around. Let's see. Hey, good morning. Hello, Glenn. How are you? How are you morning. Doing? Mike here. Hey, how, how are you? Doing? Nice, nice to meet you. you. This is Brian. Hey, this is Mike Brian. Brian. Hey, how are you doing? I just spoke with Sheldon. Yeah. Uh, he's aware of the issue that you're experiencing. Yeah. But he doesn't know if it's an active leak. Yeah, I so don't. So we're here to see it what's actually going on. So give me the full story. Because Show me the area. Yeah. So it, I first noticed Let's this see. here in the in the master area. Uh, starting to blister a little bit okay and i saw water starting to form very small drops of water start to form there about a couple of weeks ago like you know drops it's running would here. appear this toilet's running yeah, yeah that toilet needs to be okay. repaired all as right. well okay That's a separate issue all right go ahead i'm um, still listening and then it basically it's you can manifested turn that, itself you turn that here camera as there's well. a power button right there yeah turn that on out here as well, so it's possibly related to this. But it's really bad here, as you can see, this one has really bubbled up and it's really fucking up the door as well. Yeah, wow. Do you use this washer yeah. machine a lot? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. This as bathroom you can see, gets it's used. really screwing this up here, you know, screwing up the door. Yeah. Like this bathroom gets used daily? Yeah. Okay. Now, you know, the guy who built this place, you know, cut corners. Okay. You know, you see anything in there for real? Is this okay. a bit like that? Yeah, it's... Like There's small stuff here. You can see this thing's leaking here constantly, but I don't think that's the cause of it. But who knows? Wow. I need to fucking just rehab the whole place, you know? Mm. But, uh, I tell you, this floor looks dry. There's some... But I mean, yeah. some moisture there. Yeah. What do, you, what do you got on there? Let's see. Were you able to detect it there? Yeah, just to see if there's any moisture around or anything. Yeah. All right, take, it on, take a hold on to this. Let's see. <clears throat> that shower gets used daily? Yeah. And this happened months ago? Yeah, I noticed that probably four or five months ago, but the, the closet two months ago was where I started to notice that. <clears throat> There's a grout in here. Okay. 
that leaked years ago, but I think that's all fixed now because they basically re they uh, all number five was redone. Um, really? The there's a uh, there's a ton of cracks here in this grout right in these grout lines. This, area, this whole. You see this duck hen? There's yeah. There's a whole bunch of grout missing here. Right. I mean, that could be enough to cause it. Absolutely. If the integrity of the shallow pan under there is deformed, yeah, the water could be coming from anywhere. I mean, the shower head is leaking. Shower head is leaking. Yeah. So this pan is constantly wet. Um. Too bad we weren't able to test this. There's not really a curve here to test. It's really... How can you test this already? To test it, maybe fill up the pan. We would right. test the shower valve first. Yeah, you can. Test the pan. I mean, there's not really much of a curve here to fill this pan yeah. up. Some, yeah. Um, now, the neighbor downstairs hasn't noticed any leak into his unit, so mm -hmm. it's contained within here. I'd like to fill up this pan if we can. Fill up this pan, I plug it. You have that screwdriver, Brian? Give me that screwdriver. Okay, do we have an old rag or something? Yeah, yeah. Uh, a towel will do, right? We yeah, a towel will do. Let's see if we can. Yeah. We're gonna test this pan. Let's see. What do you think, Brian? There's a lot of grout missing. There's a ton of grout missing, right? Yeah. A ton of grout missing. Cells. Yeah, just one, just a small one. Actually, oh, I'm probably gonna need a smaller one. Oh, yeah, I have a, I have a like, microfiber towel. Yeah, microfiber will do. Right, let me grab a couple of those. There's one. That's fine. Uh, let's see. And you can see all of this grout missing here. You can see that big gap there. And all of that right there. All right. You cut every possible corner you got. Really? Yeah. So how long has this shower been renovated? The bathroom. Well, this is the original fitting, so it's been here since '05, and it, you know, I've lived in the unit since '07. It's been the apartment's been occupied since '07, essentially. And it's been leaking how long? Uh, the wood buckling and stuff. Like that. That's probably two years, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna fill it up. Yeah, we're gonna fill it up. We're gonna fill it up to this curve. Yeah. And we're gonna see if anything seeps out. Yeah. We'll go on the other side and it will. If it seeps out from there, then that's that's definitely your problem. That floor is dry over there, right? It's dry, but I mean it's yeah. As I say, uh, I know a couple of times, like, uh... Yeah, some water here. Is there? Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. Well, just, look at that. Mm -hmm. It just came from this wall. See if well, it shows so, it on the gun. See if it shows the moisture. Right there. It's probably, yeah, it's definitely coming from that corner. We're gonna fill it up. You see that? Oh, that. Big grout job. Yeah, definitely the grout. We're gonna fill it up. Yeah, that's a big grout job. Let's see. All right, Brian, it's up to that first tile there. It's up to that first tile, so you might be seeing something now coming. Right. Yeah, you see all these 
Yeah. This base of the where the yeah. tile meets the pan. Yeah. It's all cracked. Right. And if they didn't come up high enough with their pan, yeah. it's somehow coming coming yeah. out. Oh man. Did it show anything on the infrared gun? No, they can I believe some more to the Yeah. There is water though there, all right? And you obviously used the shower this morning, right? Yep. Yeah. Actually, no, I used the, the hey, water this, this morning. You can use that. Because I knew you guys were coming. Actually. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's coming right from... I believe it's transferring right from this corner. Yeah, through here. I believe it. I believe you. Yep. Yeah, Delta, just by just by seeing the integrity of the that tile where the tile meets the pan. Yeah. Okay. So what's the solution? Well, we're just plumbers. Yeah. You know, we don't do tiles. We don't uh, mess with the pan. Yeah. You'd have to get somebody here to either regrout. Yeah. See if that works. Yeah. Um, if not, you'd have to rip out, you know what I mean? Yeah. You'd have to rip out and, and check the integrity of the pan. Yeah. Um, but I would start by regrouting. Right. Definitely regrouting, waterproofing all these seams. Yeah. But that's, uh, you know, repairing that shallow head in the yeah. future if you wanted to. Um, but yeah, my first instinct was go straight to the tile, check the integrity of the grout. Yeah. And there is just clear indication. You can see clear it. indication, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So, um, you know, there's nothing really that, I wish I could see through walls, you know? I'd be the best plumber in the world, you know what I mean? I'd be the best plumber in the world, but... Uh, you be you don't exactly do the dishwasher, it's just that it's spreading all the way over? Yeah. It's not the dishwasher. The washer, the washer machine? I mean, I'll pull it out. I'll see if I can get behind there to see if I see any indications of anything leaking. Maybe we can do that, Brian. Okay. Maybe we also can see. Behind, there could also be some water mm -hmm. behind the, the... Oh, absolutely, yeah. Absolutely. absolutely. Yeah. yeah. The toilet's running here, too. Yeah. Let's see if we can get a peek behind that washing machine, Brian. Okay. Let's see. This way. Take out my light, right? All right, so in the meantime, we're going to disconnect this. We're going to isolate this shower because he's going away for two weeks. So, yeah, we don't want to that. yeah. and uh, that valve's not even holding. It's not holding. It's not holding. You believe that, huh? Yeah, it's not holding. All right. All right, we'll get a flapper. You got a picture of it? This guy's got some ton of issues in this fucking bathroom, right? Excuse my language, let's keep it PG rated, right? PG yeah, rated, right? Rated. <laughs> hey, he's been here since 17 years. Right? Yeah, 17 years? How long has that toilet bowl been leaking for? <laughs> 17 years? Dude, definitely been peeing some good water, bill. Oh, man. But that shower pan, that grout, yeah, on that tile is shot, what's fading, right? Man. That's what's fading, yeah. Definitely. Oh, man. I mean, it doesn't take a rocket scientist to figure that out, right? Yeah. But hey, he's getting charged for the travel time and for our time here. So it is what it is. We're giving him, we're giving him an hour of our time and uh, we're gonna see if we can repair this toilet. So let's see if we have it. Was it on the, the lowest notch on the bottom? Working on a cooler one piece toilet. I had to go pick up this flapper. Didn't have it in the truck, but Soko had it on, what was that, 27th Street? Yeah. 27th. The beauty of Manhattan. Okay, it's in. Does it sit nice? Yeah, looks good to me. Beautiful. Let's try it. It's in this. It's in. Beautiful. Nice. That valve is sweated on there? Yeah, oh, actually, right. it's thread. IPS? It's thread. Yeah? It's thread. All right. Well, we'll bring it to his attention in the future if he wants to replace it. Turn that on. Oh, 
we gotta turn on the waters off, right? The main thing over here. Let me turn that on for you. Right? You ready? All right. Damn, so be preactive. Or no, not preactive. Be proactive. And go the extra mile. So that speedy valve that we're working on. Is that a quarter turn? No, right? No, no, half inch. Change it for the customer, will you? Change it. Grab some little monster on there. Quick. There's the old in. valve here. Is it? Yeah, there's some water coming in. Alright, put that on real quick. I don't have to go that many turns. There's the old valve that wasn't holding. Guys, change it for the gentleman. Change it. We're using Everflow's lead free quarter turn. Now we're gonna give him a new supply line also. Good man, right there. This will go in the Mongo pail. And this is 3 8. How's that good? Mm -hmm. You wanna change that speedy supply oil, that toilet supply? Yeah. Yeah, change that for him too. Do the right thing, you know? Beautiful. It's hard to hold back, but there you go, turn it with your hand. Nice. Beautiful. Quarter turn more. Supply out. Got some water up here. No, just the toilet supply. It's okay. Okay. Yeah. It won't. No water will come out. You could probably do it by hand. No. You could do it right by hand. I'll hold back. Yeah. There you go. You got it. No. No good. You're not taking the nut off, right? Not the no. nut. Not the nut. Not this. Yeah, just that. Wow. It's... Okay. Okay. You're going the wrong way, right? I think so. Yeah. Yep, that way. Yep. Beautiful. Yep. Oh, yeah. Okay. Nice. Yeah, so there's, there's no water that comes out of there. If you take that other nut off, yeah. there'll be a ton of water coming out. Nice. Okay. Change that. Maybe we just put that on by hand. There's the old one. She's a crusty one. She's burnt, too. And, uh, yeah, just hand tight. Hand tight, right? Yep, that's okay. it. Oh, okay. Beautiful. Put that on. Use the Nipix so we don't scratch the finish. Beautiful. Alright, so as Brian replaced that angle stop for this gentleman, I'm going to turn the water on. We got lucky because we got two ball valves right here, which are nice. Let me show you. We got two nice ball valves in this little access panel that we're gonna open nice and slow. Do it cold first. Guys, you never want to crack this valve all the way. Nice and slow. Okay, we're gonna do this one too. Okay, just like that. Beautiful. All right, now let's go test what we did. Let's go test what Brian did, see how he did. All right. Brian, how's it look? Tank is filling up? Yep. Yeah. Good. Put these over here. All right. It looks good. Yeah. So far, okay. Oh, they're missing the, uh, they're missing the tube for that fill valve. Oh, did you turn that? Actually, turn it the other way. Yeah. All the way, yeah. More. Yeah. So it locks in place. Okay. Yeah. Okay, good. I don't know where the tube is, but it is what it is. All right, let's make sure she stops running. And, uh, she doesn't leak no more. Let's see. Go ahead. No, one less. One less? Yeah. A little one less. Make an adjustment. Let's see. <clears throat> nice. 
You're good at what you do. You take your time. That's good. Amen. You don't fall under pressure just yet. You know? We'll see you on the next one. Yeah, the next one. On the next one, right? Yeah. You want to make it out? Good. We'll replace the speedy valve that was under here. Cool. That was no good. <coughs> Garbage. Right? All right. Toilet supply. Replaced. And the flapper. So, no more running toilet. The oh, shower so this pan. This is a work in progress. Yeah. yeah, this is a work in progress. I'm going to send you my guy's info. You yeah. know, you're more than happy to shop around. But, um, yeah, you need somebody in there to take care of that. Yeah. You know? And uh, if you wanted to do that shower cartridge in the future, you could, but it looks it's like. Shower cartridge, just in case Yeah, you know to make that, that stop. Yeah, yeah, that drip right. right there. Yeah, yeah. yeah so. I'm, I assume your guy would be able to do that as well, right? Uh, No, he'll probably have to call me to come do it. But would you, yeah? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. What would you recommend there? What? To, put, to, to put in there? No, to replace the cartridge in there. Yeah. Replace the cartridge. You can keep the shower. You can keep the shower body. You just have to redo the pan. Yeah. You know, like I said, these tiles are easy to find. Right. It's just trying to match this, but, um, yeah. you know, that's something you'll have to discuss with, with yeah. him, you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 Or even Sheldon. Sheldon might recommend somebody, too. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? But uh, I'll, I'll, I'll set you up with somebody. Fair enough. Yeah, absolutely. How's that going, Brian? Good. Mm -hmm. I also need a little bit of work on the back as well, but it's not for today. What happened here? Yeah. What bad Alright guys, so there you have it. We spent a little too much time there, but I think we got it done, right? Yeah, we got, we got it, done. it done. We're set and going. Customers happy. Guys, today I mentioned earlier we are gonna make one piece of content with both service calls in it. So we're heading to the next one and um guaranteed what do we have? A scheduled shutdown, yeah, scheduled shut water shutdown to relocate a half inch domestic water line that feeds a one piece toilet. What's there now? What was it? Uh, it's, it's a total. Total one piece toilet. Customer is getting a new toilet, but the half inch domestic water line, is it's one of those concealed, tight, close quarter toilets um, that we're gonna be setting for them. So we're gonna be doing some demo. Uh, we're gonna relocate that half inch water line and uh, we're gonna rough it in due to what do they got? Toto? Another Toto? Another uh, no, Toto it's a, an American Standard Studio S. American, American Standard. Standard Studio S toilet. We're going to be roughing that in according to American Standard spec. So it should have been, well, probably is six inches left the center of the flange, but who knows where they want it now. They want it over some more, right? Yeah. So the existing one is going to be is in the way. Who's calling me now? Uh-oh, getting a phone call. But guys, we're heading to the other service call now. Get a water shut down, and I'm going to bring you along for the ride. So instead of seeing my face all day, you can look at Brian's because he's part of the <laughs> team now. And uh, let's get it rocking. That's it. We're getting yeah. it rocking. All right, guys, stay tuned. And like always, let's do yours next, baby. All right, guys, how many of you want to take a guess? I'm taking a poll. Are we getting a ticket this afternoon after this service call, or are we not? Guys, choice is yours. Leave a comment down below. I will let you know. On the first service call, we didn't get a ticket because we parked legally. Over here, over on Broadway, One World Trade. See that One World Trade? Right there? Look at that view. Those of you who haven't been to New York, look at that. That's something. That's a sight to see. Guys, we're going to knock out this other service call. And uh, let me know if you think we're going to get a ticket or not. Leave a comment down below. Here we go. <sighs> Guys, look. There's two of me. Not one, but two. I know you guys are getting sick of me, but <laughs> right here by the mirror, look at that. There's two of me. How did I do that? No, I'm not using the Insta360 camera. Guys, let's go knock out this call. Here we go. It's the American Standard Studio S that we're mounting. One piece. Very nice. Oh, it's got the bidet seat, the integrated bidet seat and everything, right? Mm -hmm. um, do you need electric over there, though? Is there an outlet there? No, we don't. No. Okay. So this is coming out here. We're gonna relocate this water line over six inches over because right now this Studio S toilet comes right in the smack of that toilet, right in the smack of that um, supply line. So I'm gonna dismantle this, remove it, and check the integrity of the flange, get a water shut down, open up this sheet wrap wall, move it over, and there's his outlet, there's toilet right there. Perfect. So. Let's uh, give it one flush. Oh, it here. It is off. Maybe it's off. I don't even know. All right, let's start unboxing the uh, the new one. All right. 
So guys, this Studio S from American Standard comes in just at about under a thousand dollars and it is a two system type flush. The first flush cleans the rim of the bowl and the next one is the actual bowl that it that it cleanses so it's nice nice bowl you got yes. yeah yeah very nice not cheap either very nice yeah powerful flush super quiet so um right now we're just looking at the installation instructions and there's our inlet here so we need a longer toilet supply that we'll get and um this is the dust cap here and here's your regulator but there's your flushing mechanism right there. But very nice toilet. Super quiet and uh, super powerful. Wow. The thing I like about this, they actually give you a tool to tighten it on this toilet. Because I'm thinking, how, how are we going to mount this toilet? How am I going to get my hand in there to mount, oh, yeah. the, to mount the bolts in there? Oh, yeah. And they actually give you a nice tool for it. Oh, that's so, cool. So, yeah, that's cool. <laughs> it was nice of them, right? It's nice of them. Guys, we got the old toilet out. There you go. <laughs> Good. We got the old toilet out. Beautiful. How's that flange look? Can you do it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Nice. Gotta take off the old wax. The old wax. Okay. Take off this. Perfect. And then we should be good. Good. And I'll so we'll open up. Here. Yeah, we'll open up first, and then you'll shut down. Yeah. Good. 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 I uh, want to take the multi tool. You got it. So they give me this nice tool here. Your knife? Where did it go? What I saw it. I just saw it too. Yeah? Alright, let's let's find it. There you go. They give me this nice tool here, T handle, to get the bolts to mount this toilet in there. So that was nice of them. So get these brown bolts. And uh, we're gonna open up the wall now and relocate this line. Here we go. By looking at the specs here. Water supply, 10 inches up from the finished floor. Actually 11 and a half. 11 and in the and center half. of the flange, yep. So we're not putting it to the left. Yeah, so mark that 11 and a half. Uh, all right, and, and the then center. just go center off of there. 17? 16 and a half. So 16 and a half? 16 and a half, boom. 16 and a half. Right there. Yeah, that's my marker. Like that. Beautiful. All right, let's get our multi tool from Milwaukee. Team Red, baby. We're gonna open that nice. Make sure you don't hit anything. Let's go easy. Let's see. You know what I like about you? You're young and you know what you're doing. Have it here. That's it. Good job. Piece of half inch copper right there. We're gonna cut it, put an elbow, swing it over eight inches, yes. come on up and done. All right, so you got that. Let me show this door. Be careful. Nice and easy, okay? So we got the area cleaned here. Uh, we're gonna get a water shut down now. Uh, right now, Brian is prefabbing some press fittings, some elbows. We're gonna do, we're gonna cut this right here. One elbow, two elbows, three elbows. Three elbows and let's use that press, let's use that press uh, speed valve we got. Press speed valve? Yeah, what do you think? Yeah, let's use that one. Yeah, three elbows. 12 inch piece of copper and we'll be good. Beautiful. All right, guys, we're using Skills new laser level. I think it's the MR9200. We're gonna put that center of the flange. And what was that spec say? 11 and a half, right? Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna put it right where they want it. 11 and a half from the finished floor. All right. Can we adjust the height of that toilet? On this toilet? No. Yeah. Comfort height, yeah. Okay. That's what it is. It's gonna stay just like that. Okay, elbow. Yeah, what did you say? Eleven and a half. Um, I mean, the first one said eleven and a half. Okay, right on top of that. All right, beautiful. So that's what we'll do. So this is like around right where the coupling is, right? Mm-hmm. The bottom of the yep. coupling. And that's where it's going. Yeah. Cut 
cut a five, five and a quarter. Okay. Five and a quarter. Five and a quarter? Yeah. Quarter. Beautiful. Center the flange. Come up. Beautiful. Five and a quarter. All right. So I'm gonna go find this meter room. Oh man, I smell sewage. Can you smell real sewage? Somebody's working here. Uh oh. What's up, guys? Oh, ejector pit, no good. Yeah, shit, man. It's done, though. Wow. What does it pick up? The bathroom here? I, that's what I thought. Yeah. But it oh, does shit. It, it, it picks up something else. Really? Yeah. Wow. All right, we're, walking, we're, we're looking for the booster pumps. Where are they? In there. This room? No. I believe in the final room. Ah, water meter room. Yeah. If I was only smart enough. <laughs> water meter room. Let's go see. Booster pumps. There they are. Wow. Uh, should we call them up or we'll shut it down now? Off, off. You want to just call them let them know maybe? Wow. I mean, they were aware. They were aware? Yeah. You feeling strong today? You want to shut that valve if you can? Yeah. Shut that valve there. Be careful. Yeah. Let me see. I got more leverage. There we go. Oh, nice. Let me see. Yeah, get in here. yeah, if you can just get in there and pull that valve up. All the way. Beautiful. Oh, man. Good job. Good job. All right. Let's go start draining. I saw a toilet down here. I saw a bathroom down here. Oh, look at this. Today's my lucky day. Wow, shit, but they're mediums though. I'll those, take them. Those I'll take them. Clean. Yeah? Try yeah. some on. Watch out for the roaches there. All right, let's open up this bathroom. Let's see. <clears throat> open up this slop sink. Oh, Are they? Yeah, look. Look at that. Nice. Yeah, now we're living in style. Look at that. They said nothing's free in this world, but those gloves are free. All right, All right, guys, give it a few minutes to drain. We got both the inlet and the outlet of this booster pump. The main is coming in right from here, up above, comes down two inch through the meter to the RPZ. Guys, the meter always comes first before the RPZ. Don't ever forget that, okay? Comes here, there's your test tee. Comes here, all two inch, boom, down to your booster pump. So make sure you turn your pumps off. You don't wanna burn them out. Two valves are closed and we're gonna start draining. How are we doing? Slowing down? A little bit. Yeah. All right. Flush that toilet too. See if we can get some more sinks open here. I'm going to check down here. Oof. It smells like cat piss and sewage all together. I'm trying to find another bathroom here, but maybe we can, we can just go upstairs and. But make sure that sink's not backing up, right? It's taking it good? Yeah. Okay. You like that, right? It's taking it good, huh? Taking it good. Like, she's taking it, that's how she likes she's it, you know? She likes it. She's taking, taking it good. good. Damn, damn. Freaking sewer ejectors. I messed with plenty of those. Oh, man. Damn it. Should, this is a baby one, so it's, it's a baby not, one. It's not too bad. The ones on the rails. The ones on the, the rails. Ones the the big. Ones. Yeah. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Now we're talking big money, though, too. Big, big money, no man. Money, no money, no honey. Oh, yeah. Wow. All right, guys, we got that draining. She's slowing down. We got this open. We got the kitchen open. No way for it to slow down. We'll cut it. Tie this in. And get on out of here. Something that I shouldn't be doing right now. Sitting down on the job. Remember when I was young, when I was Brian's age, I got fired from my first job for sitting down. It was like my second month in forming I got fired for sitting down on the job. <laughs> Think twice before you do something, guys. Let's wait for this to stop draining and uh, tie this beam again. But you know what I say to that old boss? You know what I say? Thank you. When the sun don't shine, when the sun don't shine, remember, you guys are the light. All right, and that's how it came out. Only roughed in, 11 and a half on the floor, set out of the toilet flange. Let's go turn this water back on. All right, what did you shut? You, uh, I mean, you opened something in the other bathroom? Yeah. Let's see. Let's close this. All right, guys, let's turn this on. Let's turn this water on nice and easy.
the bypass is closed one at a time okay oh, not easy sorry this isn't two inch it's three inch i lied here we go nice and easy nice and easy get more leverage i can pull it just like this nice and easy nice and easy all right let's turn our boosters on auto auto beautiful and let's go test for weeks good beautiful all right let's go test for leaks get on out of here all right bud i'm out of here okay nice job with that what'd you do replace it or yeah. replace it what'd you yeah. put in uh liberty uh yes liberty nice i got fucking heard the cavitation of the whole fucking line dude really yeah 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 it's gonna happen a lot yeah, of air in there a lot of air in there as long as it's not my house right <laughs> As long as it's not my house. Well, yes, sometimes, sometimes no, right? That's right, that's right. You have to know when to do that and when not to do that. That's right. I mean, listen, everybody has their shit, man. Everybody's you know, got their shit. shit, you know what I mean? Shit is fucking. Well, you know what I say? Their shit is my bread and butter. That's how I eat. It's true. That's how I live, man. It's true. I, I play in shit. I play in shit sometimes, too. Especially with your tools. Especially. Oh, this is fucking makes it your money. That's right. I fucking hate losing tools. That's one thing I don't want to do or losing ever do. Is, losing is, tools. This is worse, and what they're stealing from you is even fucking... Pure stupid. stupidity to lose tools. It happens sometimes. It happens, you drop it, it down a wall or something, or you but... you leave it on top sometimes, you fucking crazy. Yeah, money. yeah, yeah. But to be forgetful and lose it... All the time, man. It's no man. good, man. It's, it's no, no good. good. Good talking to you, man. I'll see you around, all right? All right brother. Take care, Stay right. blessed, man. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Good guy. Cutting some two inch no hub. Changing Liberty. Put a nice Liberty pump in there. Liberty, manual, nice. The LE40 series. It's a good pump. Yeah, and actually it's not too heavy. Not actually, too heavy, but, but expensive. Expensive. Yeah. So is, your, so is your labor. It's always something. That's right. Man. Guys, if you're not sick of me now, there's two of me. How's that? How do I look now? <laughs> funny. Guys, let's go finish this up. Let's go set this toilet, put a new deep seal wax, and get on out of here. Feet go by feel. This is what we're securing this toilet right to the floor with. And here's the other one. Take this one. And they were kind enough to give us that tool. Where is it? Tell me you, man. You got it? Cool. Yeah. Nice. Beautiful. And then that's for this one. Mm -hmm. Nice. Put the other one in there. You need light or you're good? No, I'm good. I'm just gonna hand it a little too fast. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. I'm gonna use this tool to tighten it. Beautiful. Hold it. That tool goes right through the hole where the seat can That's cool. That's him tight. Mm -hmm. Nice and straight. That looks straight. Give me this light. Nice and easy. How does that bowl feel? Let me see. They're getting tight. Oh, yeah, nice. Beautiful. Good, Good job. Alright, tie that water in. I'll tie that hose in. Don't close this tool here. We need this. Push that. Yeah, nice. Okay, I'm just make sure it's not tinted at all. Beautiful. Turn that valve on. Okay, turn that valve on nice and slow. Let's see. Let's let those tension pressure in. This thing, uh, I believe, you see that? You see the orifice in here? You see that in there? Yeah. It's another cleaning mechanism. I gotta see this. This is my first time installing this. Right nice. in Stanger Studio. Let's see. Not leaking? I'm not even silicone at this. No, I'm silicone. But what do you think we should do? You think we should be the first ones to to use this toilet? Hey, you gotta go. I gotta pee. He's got he's got a piss. <laughs> I gotta piss. Maybe we'll flip for it. We're gonna use yeah, this toilet yeah, before the customer. Point? Wanna flip for it? Yeah. Let's flip for it. I, don't have a coin I got a coin. I got a coin. Yeah, flip for it. 
Okay, what well, are you going to call it? No, I'll say tails. Call it in the air. Go ahead. Okay. Flip for it. Tails. Tails. Up, oh, wherever it falls. Is that heads? Yeah, that's heads. heads? Yeah, I get to go first. Oh, <laughs> I'm going first. And I get to keep my quarter. All right, let's give it a flush. You want to give it a flush? That was nice, right? Yeah. Hold on, let's wait for it to stop filling. And let's flush it again. Yeah, this is, let's show the people, you know? This mechanism is crazy. What, what is it? Totally it's toilet's about 13 hundred uh, pounds. Yeah, it's about 1,300 pounds. Yeah, that's pretty heavy. That's a nice toilet. I think that's better than any Toto toilet. Yeah, absolutely. Look how much water that's in the bowl. Those Toto toilets, there's no water inside the bowl. So every time you, you drop flush. a deuce, all the skid marks get caught up on, on the porcelain. <laughs> Hell yeah. And look at this white clear hose. Nice, huh? Strong flush. I put one in my house. Yeah, I would put that. I would definitely put one in my house. Hell yeah. You know what? We're going to put one in the shop one day. That's what we're going to do. We're going to spend $1,300 for a toilet and put it in the shop. If you guys want to use this toilet, give us a call. And we'll come and let you use it. You, you know what I mean? Our toilet. There you okay. go. Look at that. He's having so much fun, he keeps flushing it. We're not paying for the water. Why not? All right, I'm going to use this toilet. Right, let me use it. I'm going to use it. I'm going to clean up over here. All right. I'm sorry, but I had to use it. Let's flush it again. So, guys, we left. Some nice plastic here because... We gotta come and remove this toilet and have them make the repair. See if he likes this toilet first before he returns it, but we're gonna leave it like this. The gentleman's gonna come make his repair. We'll come back, remove it, then put it back on for him. So that's what it is. American Standard Studios. We're gonna put the plate on and put the seat on for the gentleman, but that's what it is, guys. Very nice. And there you have it. Very nice. Very nice. American Standard Studio S toilet. Very nice. But that was a while ago. Let's check to see if there is a ticket. That was 10 minutes ago. You feeling lucky? Yeah. Let's see. Brian's feeling lucky. Brian's feeling lucky. So let's see if we got a ticket or not. Let's see. I'll put this down. Are well, you going to look or you want me to look? Uh, you going to yeah, look. I'm going to go look. Here we go. Ticket or no ticket? Ticket or no ticket? No ticket. <laughs> no ticket. Oh, shit. Guys, that completes today's content. Hope everybody enjoyed it. Leave this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Like always, let's do yours next.